this 18 wheeler like literally almost ran me off the road on the way home. Wednesday morning. It is Wednesday morning. Good morning. I am running to town. I got some things I want to get um, for just some content and um, to wear when we go on our date day next week. Um, and I'm having to vlog on my phone, so bear with me. Um, I don't know what the quality of this is going to look like, but um, yeah, just go to town with me. Help me pick out something that's cute. Um, and we might go to Sonic and get a slushie. Y'all know the mango slushies are my fave. So let's go. I don't know where my mount is for my car. So I'm going to sit y'all up right here. And I just ordered some Sonic. This is a horrible angle. Oh well. I just ordered some Sonic. We're going to treat ourselves today. I love. We don't have a Starbucks here or like a Dunkin' Donuts or anything like that. So I have to order here. Hey, how are you? Good, how are you? Good. Please. Have a great day. You too. But as I was saying was, um, we don't have a Starbucks or anything here. The closest Starbucks and like Dunkin' and things like that is like 40 minutes away. So, um, those are only like treats like when we go on date days and stuff we'll go to like starbucks and stuff um so there should be a video coming up i'm not going to tell you when because i don't want it out there until after the video comes out but i am doing a video a vlog of our date day um and we will be driving over an hour away to go and we're just gonna honestly we don't do it very often but we're just gonna go and shop um and eat and just have a fun date day we may go to the movies too because there's a movie um there's an amc movie area um i think it's amc maybe it's acm i don't know it's one of them fancy um movie theaters we're gonna go um we might watch to see what, what's playing we might watch it too but it's like it's a much needed much needed so So I pulled over in the parking lot because I didn't want people like staring at me. There was this like guy uh, parked beside me a minute ago and he was just like staring and it was just... Anyways, I live in a very small town so the, the options for boutiques and things like that is very, very slim. Um, so I went into a store that we have here that's called like Factory Connection. And it's really, um, it's just like nice price things, like cheaper price, but they're really, really cute. So I went in there, I was trying to find something for date night, couldn't find anything. I'm holding my phone, so ignore my arm right here. Um, I need to go get another car mount because I don't know where mine's at. But I got this, um, the claw, the gigantic claw clips because i pull my hair up a lot i'm trying to stay out of doing like buns on top of my head because i'm trying to not as much breakage and the clips that i have at home are not like the big claw clips so i got me one of these and then i didn't really like any of the other stuff in there it was more like office type casual formal type and i wanted something cute so I just, I saw this cute little, I don't know if you call it a bralette or what, but it's this cute little, it, I just love the color of it. It's like a little bralette and I got it because I needed some more because your girl has gone up a size since she was in high school and I haven't been school shopping. School shopping? What? I haven't been clothes shopping for myself and I don't I don't do that very often and um you know I was like you know what it's time you start just treating yourself make yourself feel better 
all the things. So I'm going to drive back home, well, towards my house. There is a smaller boutique that is like literally on the road that I live on, um, like right by my house. It is a little more pricier, but they do have more girly, trendy type clothing. It's a small place and there's not a lot of parking in the parking spot. It's like, it's literally out of a house. Like they bought a house, they remodeled it and it's like a boutique. So I'm going to probably stop there if there's not a lot of people there. If not, I can probably talk Justin into going somewhere this weekend to find a cute outfit. I just want a cute outfit for date day. Like, I just want to look cute. Y'all. This 18-wheeler, like, literally almost ran me off the road on the way home. Like. So... Like, there's a four lane in between the towns that I was going to. Because, like, in our county, like, our towns are so close. And I was just, like, going down the four lane, coming back home. And there was a bunch of traffic, like, around me. And he was, like, beside me, but a little ahead. And there was cars blocking him. And there was a car in front of me with, like, a little bit of space. He just starts coming over. Just starts coming over. And I'm, like gripping my steering wheel like this is why I don't vlog driving down the road because your attention needs to be 100% on the road but um I don't even touch my phone when I'm driving but I was like gripping the steering wheel and I was like dude like like pay attention and I started like he, he was like I couldn't even see him he was so close like I could see the handlebar of his um his door that's how close he was to me and I, like, I could have reached out and touched it if I was in my passenger seat. And all of a sudden, he just, like, comes over. And I had to hit my brakes. Didn't hit them. I, like, like touched them. Like, just slow down a little bit. Like, trying to let him in that gap. Barely missed me. Like, barely missed me. I may or may not have blew my horn at him. And, like... <laughs> I have a little bit of road rage, a little bit, but he obviously didn't care. He just kept going, but I was so mad. Like this little, little white girl over here was just, was so mad and was just, yeah. <laughs> like, people need to be more careful, jeez. But I am back home. I didn't stop at that little boutique down the road because there was like five cars in the parking lot and there was cars out in the main road. Like you had to go around them, but it was like, there's a lot of people there. I don't know if they're picking up orders or what. Because they do sell stuff online too. Like on Facebook. So I'm just going to come home. I'm going to clean the house. And chill the rest of the day. And I might get on Pink Lily. And see what they have. And just order it. Before I go inside. I do want to say this too. If you follow me on Instagram. Then you know what I'm talking about. Because I kind of went into it a little bit yesterday. But... It's so hard for me on Instagram to show you every aspect of my life. What I'm trying to say is it's hard for me to show you everything about me because I feel like Instagram is such a highlight reel. And so I've kept a lot of my content homesteading because I love it. I really do like gardening, farm animals. I grew up riding horses, rodeoing, things like that. If you didn't know that about me, I used to barrel race. That. but anyways off subject i'm such a squirrel if you saw on my instagram um it's just hard for me to show you everything about my life and i have been a little afraid i'm gonna be very transparent here i have been a little afraid to show you different sides of me because a lot of y'all follow me for the gardening and homesteading i'm gonna finish this i promise but um i was a little afraid to show you different sides of me because a lot of y'all do follow me for homesteading and gardening and that's not the only thing about me like I have a countryside like I'm a country girl but I also have a girly side and I like makeup and I like all this other things and I like to shop and I just I want to be very transparent over here and I want y'all to be able to see every side of me and I don't I don't want to come off as bragging. I don't want to come off as 
I just want everybody to be able to relate and I feel like I have all of these different traits about me that many different people can relate to so we're all family here we all love each other and I love you guys so much and I thank you for watching these videos I want to show you more of me so that's why I have switched over to doing vlogging and I love it so much oh my gosh I love vlogging so much like it is I have found something that really gives me joy like I wake up in the morning and I want to vlog like I want to show you my day and it's just so much fun and it's so much easier um being vlogging and showing you every side of me versus Instagram where it's like highlight reels and it's like highlight some stories and it's you know you get what I'm saying okay I hope you understand what I'm saying anyways I love you guys I'm thankful you're here thank you for watching and I'm gonna go inside and start cleaning hi I am back home why was I so I don't know I worry myself sometimes anyways oh crap I need I need some scissors hang on I am going to pull my hair up in this closet. Is that what they're called? Anyways, I'm going to pull this hair up because it's not time to wash her, but she's not fresh, and I don't feel like putting dry shampoo in her. So we're going to pull her up in a clip. I love these scrunchies. I get them off of Amazon. Anyways, Amazon <laughs> Piranha. <laughs> I got my body an emo. I don't know. I'm so crazy. Okay. But um, I would literally put my hair up in a high bun and I would like get in the water and it would break and it was just not good for your hair. Like not good at all. So I have been seeing all these girls wear these claw clips and they are, they help with, um, your hair not breaking, you like keeping it out of your face. This is the top that I got from the store I went to this morning. So cute. <laughs> for eggs because I haven't done that today <laughs> these are the eggs we have so far all different colors excited hey guys it is the next morning I am so sorry I forgot to vlog the rest of the evening yesterday um but um thank you so much for watching yesterday was so much fun I'm so glad we got to chit chat and all that type of thing so um if you like these types of videos make sure you hit the like button subscribe if you want to i've got more videos planned for the rest of the year i'm so excited i hope you all have a great day great rest of your week and i'll see you in the next video bye guys